I'm angry, I cry. And if you see me cry when I'm angry, just know it's going to take the grace of God for, for me to forgive that particular person. So I don't get angry, but I don't forgive. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are seeing my face for the first time, my name is Faith. You are welcome. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you for always coming back to watch my video. So on this channel, we talk about beauty and others. Others include vlogs and so on. So today we are going to be talking about forgiveness. Yeah. If you've been finding it difficult to forgive or you find it difficult to forgive someone, when they hurt you, this video is for you. So guys, kindly go subscribe to my channel and we'll be back to continue this video. In general, forgiveness means letting go of grudges, anger, bitterness, um, resentment and all that. So today we are going to be talking about um, ways or um, if you've been struggling. See, one thing about me is I don't get angry. There are some set of people when you offend them the first time, they are cool with it, they let it slide, they, you offend them the third time, the second time, they let it slide, then the third one, they react. But me, you can offend me, um, in the, you can offend me 99 times, and I won't react. It might be the 100th time, the 100th time, that is when I will not react. So, what I'm trying to say is, I don't get angry, but when I do, it's actually very bad. So, when I decide to get angry, it's actually very bad. That doesn't mean when I'm angry, I destroy things. No, when I'm angry, I don't destroy things. I don't fight. When I'm angry, I don't even react. Funny, you know, I don't react. When I'm angry, I cry. And if you see me crying when I'm angry, just know it's going to take the grace of God for, for me to forgive that particular person. So I don't get angry, but I don't forgive. Or rather, let me rephrase. I find it difficult to forgive. Like, I find it difficult to forgive. That is why I don't get angry. Forgiveness does not mean you forgiving someone. It also means um, you forgiving someone and you being forgiven. We offend people daily. And some of the, it's actually important we forgive. I am actually speaking to myself. So, and I think it's actually important we forgive people who offend us because when we forgive, we, there are some benefits when we forgive. Yeah. When you forgive someone, there are some benefits that comes with forgiveness. One of the benefits of forgiveness is um, blessings. Even in the Bible, there's one, I can't remember the verse, that the Bible says if you are going to the altar to offer your gift to the Lord and you, there is somebody you've, you've, um, somebody you've not forgiven, the Bible says drop your gift and go back and make peace with the person before coming back to present your gift to the Lord. So one of the, bless, one of the benefits of forgiveness is blessing. When you forgive, you, you'll be blessed. Do you understand? You'll be blessed. Things will start working out for you. Doors will begin to open for you and so on and so forth. So the second benefit of forgiveness is freedom. Okay. For example, when I'm angry at you, when I see you, it's like something in me. There's a fire burning in me. That is how when I'm angry at you and I see you. That is how whenever, whenever I'm angry at someone, if I am angry at you, I try to avoid you. I don't want to see you. I don't want to hear your name. I don't want to think about you. I don't want people to talk about you. Yes, that is how when that is how it is for me when I'm angry at you. Do you understand? So and when I see when I'm angry at you and I see you, how do people I've heard people say they can be fighting with you and they will pass you and nothing will happen. That's not true. It's a lie. Let's be truthful to yourself. For example, somebody offends you like bitterly and you guys have not resolved it. Then you see the person coming your way and you just pass as if nothing happened. That's a lie. You feel one sharp anger or sharp pain or even if you are smiling and you are happy you are just going immediately you see the person your entire mood change do you understand like you just feel why this why this person at this time god why did you bring this person at this time do you understand so one of the second benefits of forgiveness is freedom so when you forgive there's this freedom that comes you are free your heart is free you you could walk past the person and oh hi and you are good to go do you understand and there's this peace that comes with forgiveness like somebody poured you like chilled ice water that is what forgiveness does and the third benefit of forgiveness is better relationship yes better relationship though the first relationship might not work out well due to some personal reasons but bet i bet you when you forgive the right person I use the word the right person. There are some people when you forgive them the hundred times, they will keep hurting you and hurting you. For people like them, I think we should take them to God in prayer. 
But the third benefit of forgiveness I'll be talking about is better relationship. Do you understand? If this person hurts you and you guys talk about it, you guys um trash it out and settle your um differences and you tell the person this thing you've done, please don't do it again. I bet you if the person values real friendship and real um um relationship, the person would never ever try it. Like the he or she will be trying so hard to improve or how will I put it? trying so hard to do everything to impress you he or she would not even try okay probably you have an argument with uh, maybe a friend over oh you took my thing please don't take it again don't take it again you guys just talk about it and everything next time if the person wants to go i say ah um fate already told me i shouldn't take her stuff so i won't take it to avoid any more quarrel do you guys understand so um, forgiveness opens way for better relationship, um, better conversation, and all okay, that. Matthew chapter 6, verse 14, it says, when you forgive people who offend you, your heavenly father will also forgive you. We don't forgive people, and every day when we need out to pray, we ask God for forgiveness, because we are sinners, and we're falling short of his glory, but it is his mercy and his grace that is sustaining us and keeping us alive, to understand. So please, Learn to forgive. There are so many Bible verses that talks about um, forgiveness, but I won't be talking about that today.